Hi guys! So today we're going to make this Harley Quinn Joker hat and it's actually from my Halloween costume. So let's get started. First, you're gonna need your patterns and I got my patterns from the Crafty Gemini YouTube channel. I will have the link below so you can also get the pattern as well. I have some red and some black fabric. And what I did was I folded my fabric in half and I'm gonna cut it. That way I can have two sheets of red because you're going to need four pieces of the head in red and four pieces of the head in black and then you're going to need two pieces of the headband in red and two pieces of the headband in black. So I'm pinning down my pattern and I'm going to cut around it. For the headband, I have two pieces of black, two pieces of red, and four pieces of the red for the head, and four pieces of the black for the head. Then you want to separate them, and you want to do red to black, and then pin down on one side of the head. And then black to red, and pin down on one side of the head. You want to repeat the same step for the other two. Here I have them all pinned down and what I'm going to do now is using my sewing machine I'm going to do a straight stitch all the way down from the top to the bottom just on the side that I pinned. Now I have completed all four of them and there's a good side and a bad side. The bad side is where you have your stitches. Now with the good side facing each other you want to do red to red and black to black. Then you want to pin them down together and you want to pin it all the way around the hat except for the bottom part. I have both of them all pinned up so now I'm going to do a straight stitch around where I pin. And here we have our hat all finished. Well, not quite yet. Now we're gonna go ahead and work on the headband. You wanna take your red and your black and you wanna cut them in half. I have two pieces of red here, but you only need one piece because once you cut it in half, you're gonna get two pieces of red and two pieces of black. Now, once you finish cutting them, you wanna put them together red to black. And then you wanna put some stitches at the top and at the bottom. So now we want to go ahead and attach the headband to the hat. And we want to flip the hat so that the hat has the good side on the outside. And then for the headband, we want to make sure that the bad side is the outside. Go ahead and pin together your headband and your hat. Then go ahead and do a straight stitch all the way around the hat. Then you want to repeat the same step for your other hat. Now that we finish attaching the headband to both of our hats, we want to go ahead and flip the hat inside out so that the bad side is the outside. And we want to stuck them in together and then we want to line them up, but make sure that it's the red to the red and the black to the black. And then go ahead and pin the two hats together. 
that we want to do a straight stitch all the way around the entire hat. We want to make sure we leave about an inch open so that we can flip the hat inside out so that way the pretty side will come out of the hat. So here I have my so-called horns. I already went ahead and cut them out. I don't have a pattern for them. I just kind of eyeball them. Um, just cut it to however you like it, how curvy you like, or how long or how short you want your horns to be on the hat. Um, here I'm gonna go ahead and do a straight stitch on them. Now that they're completed, I'm gonna flip them inside out so the pretty side could come out. Then you wanna go ahead and take your plush or whatever you're gonna to use to fill in your horn and go ahead and just fill them up. Fill it up to however you like it, how soft or how tight you like. I'm just gonna fill it up to however I like it. So here they are. I'm just gonna match them black to black and red to red and also double checking to make sure that they are the same length and the same size. Once they are what I want them to be, then I'm going to go ahead and do a straight stitch on the bottom to close it up. You want to go ahead and preheat your hot glue gun because you're going to need it. Once you finish stitching them, then you want to go ahead and take your hot glue gun and add some glue to the bottom of your horn and stick it right onto your hat. Make sure you measure them and you know exactly where you're gonna put it so it's not crooked. And you're gonna do the same thing on the red side. Now I'm gonna take some cotton balls and I'm gonna put a dab of glue at the top of the ball and then attach it right onto the top of the horn and just hold it in place for a couple seconds. And repeat the same step to the other side. Here it is, the finished product. Thank you for watching and I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. A huge shout out to KMX Photography for doing such a wonderful job putting together this video for me. I will have his link right below too. Don't forget to check out his videos as well. Thank you and see you guys next time.